It is the people who elected me and not members of parliament. Those are the words by Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa responding to talks of an impeachment motion being prepared against him. The DP, who spoke during his visit to the Marikiti market here in Nairobi and other stopovers within the city, warning those against him not to dare him. However, his troops were more direct and brutal, directing their jabs to President William Ruto, who they accuse of orchestrating Gashagwa's wars by paying MPs at State House. This is an apparent repeat of the 2022 campaign period when the DP's troops then occasionally took on the president in an apparent full endorsement of their boss. Here is Ibrahim Karanja with that report. There have been days of intense political beatings against him, orchestrated by those who just recently he considered as his own teammates. What started as a vote of no confidence by 13 members of parliament from the Mount Kenya East region quickly spread like bushfire to 48 of their colleagues in the western region of the mountain. Then to members of the county assemblies and later to a section of elders has left Gashagua a near isolated man. To cap it all, talks of an impending impeachment have been rife. <laughs> Yet all along and amidst the intense political heat, the man from Madeira has been silent, only slightly brushing over the debate in his public appearances, but not anymore. <laughs> Sisi tuketaka kuambia hawa kama muko na shida na regadhi kashagua mkuja mshitaki ye kwa hawa na inchi hawa Na imefika wakati wakuongea Tumeachana na umwa tunaenda kwa mwenyewe Tumeachana na umwa tunaenda kwa nani? Kwa mwenyewe Kwa hivyo tunataka kumuambia mdosi abani raisi wa jamhuri President Ruto, while speaking in Gashagwa's Nyeri home turf on Sunday, preached against premature 2027 campaigns, instead calling on a focus on development. Gashagwa's faction hearing none of it, using Ruto's own dose of medicine against him. Uko 2027, ni mungu na wananchi. Ndiyo watamua. Lakini wezu kutunusuta, na lawe, bado kwa kwa siyasa ya 2027, na wana tuambia tuachana na yo. Hatufami bottom mzasa, ni ground up. Ground up. But as Gashagwa was putting up a spirited defiance in Nairobi, still pinning a nail on him miles away in Tharakanithi is CS Kindiki's own governor, Muthomi Njuki, who cites Gashagwa's loud absence from two major functions with the president, one in Nyeri on Sunday and another at State House with Nyeri leaders, as enough reason that he needs to be replaced. <laughs> Wakati zinapangwa zinagawa, tukiangalia pale mbele, yule tulituma ayuko, wacha tutume wale watu wanafanya nini, wanafika. The spot between Rigadi and Ruto is a deja vu political phenomenon. Just two years ago, the duo was in one corner against their then boss Uhuru Kenyatta. And although the end was rather clear in 2022 since Uhuru was completing his second term as president, how it will end for Gashagwa and Ruto, who are yet to serve as the first half of their first term, is a matter of wait and see. Ibrahim Karanja, NTV. Yes.
Ibrahim.